Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how to make a website just like what I did. HTTP colon forward slash forward slash www.chrisleyjkproductions.tk I thank EvilDude221's channel for teaching me how to do this. I, I give all the credit to him. He's a good guy, so go check him out. His videos are awesome. Okay, first of all, let's get started. What you want to download is Dropbox. See, click the link, download Dropbox, and just save the file. I'm not going to install it because I already did. It's like a typical win Windows install Windows install. So, yeah, you got to make an account, but after that, you don't need to be in that account. It's just to get started. Okay. Now I'm going to minimize that. And now I'm going to use Adobe Dreamweaver to make this thing. It's a add um an HTML and PHP whatever website creator. It's not free, but you can get the trial or buy it, whatever. Okay, what you want to do is go open up Dreamweaver. Just let it load. And what you want to make a new HTML document. This one. Like this. And like and you make the title whatever you want. I I can name it. Just name it what you want. I'll call this one Christy JK Home. And what you want to do is go to File and Save As. Where you want to save it is go into your Documents and Settings or if you're using XP or or your folder in Vista and Windows 7. Okay, you go to there and they go to Documents and then My Dropbox and then Public and what you want to call this thing it's very specific and it's called index.html and then you save it. I'm not going to save it because my site's in there and I don't want the home page to be gone. Okay, so I'm going to cancel and you can make any you can make more sites like like save as many sites as you want. But now on the other page, on the other page, you want to make a, on your main page, you want to make a link to the website, like, like, see, about, and whatever. I'll just type that text. Let's just say that's a different page, okay? And now, on properties, you want to go to HTML. Okay, you can click that, and link. You get a browse file and f link it to whatever page you made for the about. Double click that. And I will show that message again. And there's a link to it. Okay, in the about page, you gotta be. Sh well, I'll just make another document for that. HTML, whatever. And to get back to your original page, I'll just type type what you want to get back. I'm just going to type back to home. And highlight that. Go to HTML when it's already there. And browse for a file and redirect it to go back to index.html yeah
that's very important or your site won't function properly. You can't go back. Maybe you can, but you have to press the refresh button and no one likes that, doing that. Okay. Now, this is very basic due to the lack of time. You can insert a image, like a banner thing, whatever, and you, or you can insert animated SWF thing. Ah, uh, I don't feel like saving it. You could do that. I can make a another tutorial on how to do that. Anyway, once it does, once it's on, what you want to get, go with. Two is my computer and your hard drive, the C drive, or whatever thing you use to install Windows on, and and documents and settings or users, then your user, whatever, and then documents right there, and my Dropbox folder then public and then index.html what you want to do is go see the Dropbox option and then you want to copy public link okay once you do that you go into your browser yeah, Firefox let me use that and you paste that and you go as you see your site is working now so yeah that's good now what you want to do is go into the this page right here http colon forward slash forward slash www dot dot tk en forward slash and page whatever that stuff is and you want to once you're there you want to press web domain and what you want to do is go copy that thing and go next oops oh you can make it a different .tk this is the domain name you want. My bad. I'll just make a bunch of random letters now. And go, you go to next. You want a free domain. Because I really don't feel like paying for it. You can go to next. And type in the URL you made your site on, like, kind of like this. And let's oh I can't delete that and then you gotta type in the characters you see H A G P Q I W O that's the verification letters then you press next oh you gotta enter your email address sorry um, I'm not going to do that due to personal information. Yeah, but that's basically your domain. Make sure to remember that. Add it as a bookmark, like, like I have here. And that's pretty much it. I'll go in, get into bigger detail if I get a chance. Anyways, thanks for watching this video. Again, all credit goes to Evil Dude 221 and thank you for watching and see you later YouTube peace